buong mundo. Nai tay kapuso. Pahinam po ng 20 minutes ng inyong hapon. Ako po si Boy, and welcome to Fast Talk with Boy Abunda. Sa lahat ng sumusubaybay po sa atin, sa ating mga live streaming channel sa Facebook at YouTube, maraming salamat. Sa lahat ng nakikinig sa DZWB, welcome to the program. Ten days to Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Sang Susan! Sampung araw na lamang po. This is, again, a very special afternoon dahil ang ating bisita ngayong hapon ay hindi lamang supermodel, hindi lamang beauty queen, hindi lamang actress. Siya po ay isang kaibigan. Naitay ka puso, please welcome, Melanie Marquez! <laughs> maraming maraming salamat, Mimi. So much Thank inviting. you. Of course, please, please. Uh, kumusta? Kumusta ang Pasko? Mabuti. How's everything? God is good. Everything is fine. Iba pa rin talaga ang datingan, di ba? Pero siyempre, uh, Mimi, uh, ilang linggo lang pinag-usapan at patuloy pa rin pinag-uusapan ang performance ni Michelle yes. sa El Salvador. And you were there. Yes. Ikaw, uh, pag binabalikan mo yung karanasan na nandun ka, pinapanood mo ang iyong anak, ano yung, ano yung tumatak talaga sa'yo? Ang sa totoo lang, Kuya Boy, sinupresa ako ng anak ko eh. Yung expectation ko na gusto ko makita, hinigitan niya. Ang sabi ko lang sa anak ko bago umalis, anak, put a mark in everything you do na hindi makakalimutan ng tao. Dahil kapag original ka, sabi kong ganoon, talagang tatatak yan sa utak nila at you will always be remembered. So, yung mga lahat ng damit niya, tsaka yung lahat ng swimwear niya, yeah, right. nasyak akong ganoon. Sabi ko, <laughs> anak ko ba ito? <laughs> yung galing-galing niya. I know how proud you are yes. that I am a bisexual. Ano ang naging reaction mo, Mimi? Well, wala naman ano. Sa akin kasi, I always believe that Where my children be happy? Siempre, alam naman nila yung right and wrong. So when it comes to their choices in life, I just let them know the consequences of what will happen. So the rest will be your choices. Ganun na respeto ko binibigay sa mga anak ko. Hindi ako diktador. Disciplinary na ako pero hindi ako diktador. Tama. Oh. So kaya I get along with my children. 1916, our very first Miss Universe Gloria Diaz was interviewed. Yes. Sabi niya, um, napunta doon sa usapan na binigyan ka niya ng uh, rating. Tama ba ako? Uh, if I were to rate Melanie and Michelle, I give Melanie a 10 and I give Michelle an 8. Anong yung comment? I'm, I'm so flattered. <laughs> Thank you so much, Miss Gloria Diaz. Well, for me, um, Opinion nila yan. I have to respect everybody's opinion. You can never please. Pero anybody. opinion ito ng Miss Universe oh, natin. Oh, di ba? But I'm I'm just so grateful. Ever since talaga gratitude ko kay Miss Gloria Diaz, which I knew when in my time, talagang pinaglaban niya ako. Saan yun? Sa binibini? Sa binibini ng Pilipinas. Oh, yes, paano kanya pinaglaban? Pinaglaban niya na kailangan meron corona ako. In some okay. way, because he know she can see that I am actually the person who will carry and win a, a crown internationally. So, kung baga, kahit nung naka, nakatayo kami lahat, lahat siya ganyan, nag-stop siya in the middle kasi I am the tallest, and said, I want you to win. Sabi niya talaga, tapos sabay siya siya, na siyang pakialam. And ako naman, ay... Thank you. Sabi ko na, nag-boost talaga yung ego ko and whatever. Nagkaroon ako ng confidence. Kasi hindi ko naman alam. That's why I joined the Bini Bini before. I just wanted to have a car. And they were giving free cars doon. And hindi ko naman alam na competition na pala talaga ito. Kailangan one of the major award titles. Mapanalunan. Oo. Hindi ko kasi binasa yung poster. Sabi lang kasi sa akin ni Mama Rene, once you get into Bini Bini Pilipinas, you're gonna have a car. Granted. So I took that word. So when I got into the Bini Bini, I said, where's my car? Sabi naman nila, what are you talking about? Well, my designer told me that I'm going to have a car once I get in. I am in. 
So, where's my card? So, sabi ni sa akin ni Mr. M, si direct, director namin yun, have you read the poster? I said, no. So, why don't you read it so you will understand? So, I read it. What? I have to compete the major award? Hindi <laughs> pala ako talaga knowledge. Yung pala ang kwento nun. Dati, even as a model and as a beauty queen, ito yung napapag-usapan natin na madalas, iba yung dating mo. You know? Tayo, lakad, at uh, nung lumabas si Michelle po doon sa swimwear, competition ng top 20, marami, hindi lamang po ako, at least sa mga kaibigan natin, ang reaksyon namin, ay, sinapian ni Melanie Marquez. <laughs> Let's stand, para lang makita nila. <laughs> Una muna yung post, kasi you have a post, uh, Mimina, iba eh. Diba? This, is the uh, this is the camera, sa bang camera namin. Uh, how, how do you do that? No, because before, when I started the modeling stint, they used to post like this, bend knees. Naka-bend knees sila. So, instead of you looking taller, you were a little bit Tap shorter. Okay. Diba? Tapos fa false eyelashes. Which I refused to stand that way. So, I sta started standing straight. And nag-strive ako. Ah, then I walk. Pero ang nagturo niyan, Mimi, ikaw lang. Yes, ano, self-study. Pero nang naging beauty queen, nabago ba yan? Ang konti. Paano? Well, this time, of course, hindi na masyadong um, high-tech. Kailangan uh -oh. may corona. Lagi kong iniisip, kailangan may corona ako. Kailangan elegant ang lakad ko, suabi lang. Konti. Since may balakang ako, hindi ko talaga sinisway. Okay. Tapos nakapusod lang para makita nila yung cheekbone ko lahat. Okay. Di ba malinis? So, hindi masway? Hindi. hindi Kasi mas... may balakang ako eh. Pero pag walang balakang, Ay, that's when... Ay, kaya sway mo. Gaya kaya lang, umagano ka talaga. Ganyan. Oh, oh. Para mapansin. Yes, of course. Para yung shape mo. Correct. Nakikita. Alam mo, may ideya ako. Let's do fast talk na wala tayong gagawin. Kundi <laughs> lakad tayo ng lakad. Katuwaan lang. ba? Susunod lang ako ng susunod. First time po itong gagawin namin. Diba? Uh, in other words, pag tinanong kita, basta lakad ka lang ng lakad. Kahit okay. paikot-ikot dito, okay lang. Para makita nila ang lakad ng uh, Mimilani. Okay. Let's do fast talk. Okay. Let's start. Sige, lakad ka lang ng lakad. Paris o Pampanga? Pampanga, of course. Oh, beauty or brains? Oh, brain and I can be beautiful once you have brain. Supermodel or beauty queen? I'd like to be supermodel. Acting or modeling? Modeling. Drama or comedy? Comedy. Untold story or shocking story? <gasps> Untold story. High heels, flats? High heels, of course. Long legs or long hair? Long legs. Sardinas or steak? <laughs> steak. <laughs> Pangarap noong bata ka? <gasps> Maging isang known personality. Masaya ka kapag? Masaya ako kapag may ginagawa akong kabutihan sa kapwa ko. You feel beautiful when? When I am in my kind gesture. You feel sexy when? In bed. Naiinis ka kapag? Sinungali ang karakarap ko. Kinikilig ka kapag? Nandiyan yung iniidulo ko. Pinakaayaw mo sa tao ang? Sinungaling. Engineer or lawyer? <gasps> lawyer is liars. What? I love liars. <laughs> Global or international? <gasps> of course, international. No lipstick, no kilay. <gasps> no lipstick? No, no kilay na lang. Oo, oh, 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 hindi. My favorite kang anak. Wala mo siya. Oo, oh, 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 hindi. Mas maganda ko. si Michelle sa'yo. Mas maganda anak ko siya. Oo, oh, 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 hindi. Mas sexy si Michelle sa'yo. Ay, oh, sige na nga ang anak ko. <laughs> lights on or lights off? Lights on. Happiness or chocolates? I like happiness. Best time for happiness? Am I going to say it? <laughs> Complete the sentence. I am Melanie Marquez. I am beautiful because... I have a kind heart, Kuya Boy. Oh. <laughs> Pahinga tayo. <laughs> Nakakatuwa. Pero uh, ito, Mimi, I don't know if uh, we've talked about this on air, pero ang dami-daming mga melanisms. But yes. I, I know we spoke about this before because we were planning to have a book. Naalala yes. mo. Pero 
alin dito ang totoo, alin ang hindi. Kasi okay. may mga invento na eh. Yes, yes, Katulad yes. limbawa ng, don't judge my brother, he's not a book. Why should I have a calling card? I'm not a call girl. Alin ho dito sa mga melanisms na ito ang totoo, ano ang hindi, malalaman ho natin sa pagbabalik ng Fast Talk with Boy Abu. <laughs> Kami nagbabalik po dito sa Fast Talk with Boy Abunda. Kasama pa rin po natin ang isa sa pinakamagandang babae sa buong mundo, Melanie Marquez. Thank you, Kuya Boy. Mimi, pag-usapan natin itong mga melanisms. I know there was a time that we were planning to do a book and yes. you were planning to do a book. Anong nangyari nun? Wala. Ang dami ko kasing ginawa. Eh. Oo nga eh. So, medyo na, ano ko, na distract ako in some ways. But not too late. I mean, you know, yes, in, in God's true. good time. Pero ang nais nice nating malaman ngayon, dito sa mga Uh, nasa social media, mga naisulat, ano dito yung totoo, ano yung hindi? Sige. I mean, uh, katuwaan lamang. Let's uh -huh. go to the first one. Okay, let's go to the first one. I won't change my legs because I'm contented with my long-legged. Is that true? Yes, that's true. So, ito yung sinagot ko sa Binibining Pilipinas. Okay. If I'm willing to exchange my legs to Janice Dickinson, which is insured with one million dow. So, uh -huh. no. Uh -huh. I will not change my legs because I am contented with my long legged. Oh, no. grammatically wrong, but naitindihan. You deliver the, yeah, you deliver the message, yes. di ba? Pag, pag halimbawa, Mimi, naririnig mo yan uh, sa mga tao, natatawa ka, napipikon ka, how, how do you react? Natatawa ako kasi totoo. Oo, <laughs> punta natin ang pangalawa. Let's go to the next one. Don't judge my brother. He is not a book. Oo, nangyari din yan. Ah, talaga? Yes, sa debate. Uh, isa ako sa mga... Finalists. Uh, finalists nila. Na ang yung isa, sabi ng ganoon, uh, kung pwede daw mag, may asawa yung mga pinapatulay. Sabi ko, hindi. Kung nung hindi, may nagtatatalak doon sa kabila na fan. Eh, sabi ko, ay nakalimutan ko yung saying na don't judge a book by its... Uh, don't judge my brother sa... Sa likod ng ano ko, ng isip, sa, Melanie, kumpletohin mo, sasabihin mo, kumpletohin mo. He's not a book. Sabi ko. Yan na sabi ko. Brother here was Joey, Joey Marquez. Yes. It's happened in a debate. Let's go to the third one. Yung pala ang kwento behind the thing. Okay, let's go to the next one. I don't eat meat. I'm not a carnival. Ay! Nasabi ko yun. Nasabi mo rin ito. Tapos saan? Saan? Ang kwento? Pinag-uusapan nila kasi yung sheep, yung mga lamb and everything. I don't really eat that. I meet sila, di ba? Okay. So yun, ang feeling ko talaga, hindi ako carnivalius. Pero tinatawanan mo lang ito, no? Okay. So nasabi rin ni Mimi ito. Let's go to the next one. Ang tatay ko, ang only living legend na buhay. Anong buhay pa tatay ko? Oo, correct. Nasabi ko rin yan. Ano naman ang ano? Ano naman ang context ko nun? Kasi naman, ang dami-dami na binibigyan kung sino-sino ang award ng daddy ko naman ang nagumpisa ng pito-pito. Kahit naman sabi mo one week lang yung dinarek, yung minsan iiyak ka doon sa ginawa niyang ano, pelikula, kaya tatawa ka. Tapos ang sabi ko, ang tatay ko hindi nabibigyan ng award. Eh, living legend siya, nabuhay. Okay, let's go to the next one. Why should I have a calling card? I'm not a call girl. Ay, talaga, totoo din yan. Ano naman ano? Ano naman ang story nito? Ay, kasi naman, si Tita Conchi. May mga parties, di ba? Oo, may parties. Eh, meron isang bachelor ng Baron Dow from England. Gusto niyo makilala yung mga model niya na single. So, eh, ako naman... Tinitraining niya ako to become a ladylike. So, first time ako na, umihiwalay na nga ako sa lahat. Umiiwas. Umiiwas kasi nga ayoko nga ma-entertain ma yung, yung guest. Tapos yung guest na yun, yung, yung baron. Ba? Yung baron, siya ba nakita pa ako, ako linapitan. Oh. So, ako naman, I have to be polite si Tita Conching dyan. 
Oh. Nasa likod, ganyan, nag, nakikinikinig. Sabi yung ganun yung guy. Sabi niya, you know, here's my calling card. You can call me anytime. I will be here anytime you need me. I said, just to be polite, thank you. What is your name, by the way, sabi sa akin. Oh, well, I'm Melanie, sir. Sabi niya, oh, I see then. I just kept quiet. And then sabi naman yung guy, parang, parang lang ano, um, excuse me, do you have a calling card? Sabi niya sa akin, para na offend ako. <laughs> Nag-iiba na yung reaction ng mukha ko. Ang sabi ko, why should I have a calling card? I'm not a call girl. Sabi ko, hindi na kunchi. Fell down. Para siguro hindi na bumukas yung bibig ko. Magkamali. Ay, nag-sempre, commotion, nandun na kami, no? Hinimatay siya sa kahihiyan. <laughs> Dadagdag ko ako ng konti doon. Si Tina Kunching, Suniko, uh, is the same lady who somehow raised Mimilani, and I was a production assistant. Uh, Tita would host kasi, she was ambassador at large uh, during Makapagal's time, and she was called the Duyen of Manila's 400. So, madalas siya mag-host ng mga parties. So, uh, ilan sa mga parties ito, mga ambassadors, yun yung mga yes. barons, and kung sino-sino pa. Ito yung uh, konteksto ng sinasabi ni Mimi. Pero iwanan natin ito mga melanisms. Um, let's talk about you being a mother. Kanina, you started to talk about uh, your children. Kumusta ka bilang isang ina? I wish my children are the one who's being interviewed. Correct. Not me, but me as a, 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 a parent, a mother, I'm a very loving mom, but disciplinarian ako. I'm very strict when it comes to education. Kasi yan lang ang pwedeng mana na ma, maiiwan ko sa mga anak ko, yung dunong, yung katalinuhan, at saka yung magandang values. Values na dapat maging ano ka, down to earth. You know, you have to be kind to other people. Give respect. If you respect yourself, of course you want to be respected. Then respect other people. Ito naman, Mimi, you don't have to stand dyan ka lamang because ipinagmamayabang ko lagi that uh, iba yung panahon nyo. Kasi ka ako napapanood ko lang kayo, iba yung pagdadala nyo. Like for example, I don't know if you know this, but every time we would do pictorials, aliw na aliw ako kung paano nyo ginagawa. Uh, at gagawin natin ngayon yan, may photographer ho kami dito. Ang gagawin lang ho, uh, ito naman para sa, sa mga stills, yung mga covers ng magazines. Uh, ang photographer na ito po ay resident photographer po ng Fast Talk. Uh, siya po ay si Bonito J. Uh, <laughs> Maraming salamat, Bonito, at kami pinagbigyan mo. Uh, beauty queen, Melanie Marquez. Subukan lang natin. Pero bibilang ka. One, two, three, and then she'll do a pose. Uh, gusto ko lang ma-expose ang kabataan ngayon kung paano ginagawa uh, ang pictorial. You know, you, you had your way, di ba? Yes. One, two, three, pak! Yung... Depende kasi kung anong suit ko eh. Kapag ako nasa bathing suit, I always raise my hands to stretch my my body. Ah, okay, pag Parang swimwear. Shape. Yes, swimwear. Itong ating photographer ngayon, nung una mong nakita, anong pose ang gusto mong gawin? Of course, nasa business ano ako. Oo. Oh. Oo. Oh. Oh. Ngayon, ha? So, akong bibilang, ha? Akong bibilang. Bonito, ah, uh, pagbuti ano, si Bonito J po ito. Okay. One, two, three, pose! Ah. One, two, three, pose! Ah. One, two, three, pose! Last. One, two, three, go! Oh, boy. Bonito. Bonito, Jay. Maraming maraming salamat. Maraming salamat. Thank you very much. Galing mo. Diba? At saka hindi pwedeng wala kang focus talaga, no? Kailangan. Kailangan. You have to be present. Yes, of course. It needs a lot of ano, yung focus center. Sabi ko nga, we can talk forever, pero ito'y kapaskuhan. Uh, tapusin natin dito, Mimi. Ano ang iyong dasal ngayon sa iyong buhay? Ang dasal ko sana, na patuloy na maganda ang health ko at masaya ka tayong lahat po. At na, na way, magmahalan tayo at huwag mag-away. Na damdamin natin po ang pagmamahal ng Panginoon sa ating buhay. Hmm. Salamat. Oh, thank you. Love you. Love you. Maraming maraming salamat. Thank you. Uh, the one and the only, Melanie Marquez. Yes!
Nay tay kapuso, maraming salamat po sa inyong pagpapatuloy sa amin sa inyong mga tahanan at puso araw-araw. Stay kind. Make your nanay and tatay proud. Hashtag say thank you. Do one good thing a day, and let's make this world a better place. Maraming salamat, boyso. Chris Jazzler, goodbye for now, and God bless.